What is up everyone? So today I want to talk to you about Transcribe. It is a software that helps me literally every single day of my life. I bought it when I was in college several years ago, probably six, six or so years ago. I've used it almost every day since then. It cost me $39 and it is well, well worth that price. Um, so let me walk you through what exactly is going on with this program. So this program I use every day to help me transcribe drums or music. So uh, I'm going to walk you through all, most of the main features, okay? So the biggest, biggest thing that this program helps me with is that it, tr that it can slow down audio instantly while maintaining pitch. So all of us are familiar with that feeling of when you slow down audio and then it sounds really slow and do the pitch changes and it sounds really weird and warped and everything. Transcribe changes all of that right in real time. It is just amazing. So let me play you this clip right here. And as you can see, you can pull up just audio or audio and video. As you can see, there's a video on the screen right now. So if I play it, it sounds like this. Cool, that's me playing drums, whatever. So all I have to do to slow down the tempo is literally click the 50% speed and then hit play again, which is spacebar. And as you can hear, it slowed down the auto, audio without changing the pitch. So the drums are still easy to hear. It's still easy to hear what's going on because the pitch hasn't shifted. Uh, and this is important for any instrument. You know, if you're transcribing piano and you slow down the audio, the pitch has changed, that's a problem. But with drums, floor toms and kick drums, if you slow down traditional by a traditional means, uh, floor toms and kick drums start sounding exactly the same. So with using this program, uh, it's easier to hear kick drums from floor toms and all of that you know, good stuff. So that's the first feature, being able to do that on the fly. Um, a couple other things, there's a little piano here that you can, if you are trying to get pitched instruments, you can use that. I'm going to get that out of the way because we're talking about drums here. Um, another great feature is you can loop instantly. So that loop is set up, so now I don't have to keep hitting spacebar, like, I don't have to keep going back to it, you know. So this is great for, trans. if I'm trying to transcribe this one bar of drums, this is great, but if you're trying to transcribe a whole song, and you want to hear the verse, and you're trying to get the chords for the verse, this is a great way to loop so that you don't have to keep going back and clicking the beginning of the verse, and then waiting a second for it to actually get to the first part. of the This gets you right in where you need to. Hit spacebar. <laughs> and it's looped automatically, so that is great. So another feature I really like is the, you, you can export these files as slowed down audio or video. So if I go to this file menu right here, you'll see it says export sound right here, or export video. If I go to export video, I can actually, I can actually select whether I want the whole file or the current selection. I'll do the current selection, and I can pick where I want to save it by browsing or just typing in the name. And I can click here. This is the important part. Right here, it says speed. I can select that. And now, since I am selected on 35% speed, when I export this video, it will play back at 35% speed. Let's hit OK. It'll write the video. And it'll take a second. And you can do this for audio too. So if you only have audio loaded in, you can export just, it's the same thing, it's just audio. So now I can pull up this video. And that's my playing at 35% speed. So this is really great. A lot of my clients who have want stuff transcribed, what I'll do is I will transcribe something and then send them a file of the transcription they ordered uh, at 50% speed too, which allows them when they're learning something to be able to plug that in. They don't have to be at a computer or buy this software. They can be at their, with their iPhone in the practice room and they can pull up these files I've created for them and, you know, practice along with the transcription at 50% speed. So this software is amazing. You know, like I mentioned briefly, 
you can go in and you can EQ different things. Um, you can tune certain things. Uh, and then obviously the speed component. And the looping. I think the looping is really important. You know, you can zoom out here and get a bigger section to loop. Um, but I, I just love this software. It's $39 and it is well worth it. So if you go on the bottom of this page, you'll see two different links, whether you're on Mac OS or Windows. Uh, I have it for both. I have a Windows machine, which is what you've been seeing here, and I have a Mac. It's always worked flawlessly. It's a really lightweight program. It doesn't hog a lot of CPU for you tech nerds. Um, I've, I've never had it, you know, overload the system. It's not a very, you know, so it's a great piece of software. It's $39. If you use the links below, uh, it won't be any more. It's always $39. And if you use the links below, it'll still be $39. But I do get a commission for the purchase. Um, they have an affiliate program and the links below will give me a kickback from purchasing through my links because they will reward me for sending you your business. I can't stand by this product enough. Um, there are other slowdown softwares that um, when you, they can do these same features, but when you export the audio at a slower tempo, it starts to degrade the quality. I think Transcribe, the algorithm they use to slow stuff down, sounds better than anyone else out there. Um, so I hope you check it out. I uh, hope this was helpful. If you have any questions, email me, timbuelmusic at gmail, or if you're on my website, just contact me through my website. Um, thanks for watching, and I hope this helps. I'd love to know. If you do download it, I'd love to know how it goes, how it's helpful. So thanks for watching, and uh, I'll talk to you soon.